forbidden world that must never be discovered. I heard something. And an adventure. This is so cool. They will never forget. This is a movie uh, about a uh, dysfunctional family, a mom and two boys, who move from a uh, big city into some podunk small town that uh, we don't quite know why they had to move, but there's some reason, some bad reason. And the kids are really bored and unhappy at this new place, and except for the girl next door, they kind of like her. But uh, down in the basement, they find a door, and the door has locks on it. And uh, they spend all their time trying to figure out how do we, how do we get this open, what's inside. Needless to say, it's a horror movie. They get it open, and they find dot, 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 go see the movie. I really liked the way Joe put it all together. I thought the way he kind of cut it together and made the scares um, works really, really well. Um, it was it was a little scary being on set just because, um, you know, I kind of have, you know, some basements kind of get to me, like just kind of being in a basement. And the set for um, the whole was awesome. Light coming through a crack in the wall. <sighs> or an alien. Or an egg. Or an alien egg. How do you even come up with this? It's not in The problem with, art, with horror movies is that if it doesn't have an R, um, the kids think, well, how, it must be Namby Pamby. It must be, you know, it must be for tiny tots, you know. Uh, and, and, and some of the PG-13 movies have been pretty tough. It's a dark movie. And um, the trick is how dark can you get and still be appropriate. Forget about the ratings, just appropriate to be able to bring kids to. And... Uh, in my mind, this was always seemed to be a, a ten and up movie for me. It brings your fears to life. You've got a gateway to hell under your house. And that was really cool.